Bonjour from France. But since we are going to talk about finding work in Italy, we are going to drive through the mountains here from France to the other side into Italy. So if you are interested in finding a job in this beautiful country of Italy, then join me on this adventure as we learn together how we can find jobs here in Italy and see what's the job market like in this beautiful country. Let's do this. Hello. One ticket, please. One? Yeah. Messi. Over. Over. So we are going to go through the tunnel to Italy. The tunnel is about what? 12 kilometers? Yes, it's 12, 12 kilometers. kilometers. Okay. As we make our way through the mountains into Italy, I would like to introduce my travel partner from Nepal. Hi. Well, it's not as grumpy as... Buongiorno in Italy. So that's the border between France and Italy. That's that we are going to cross right now. As you can see, there's no one checking anything on the borders. So, cool. We are good to go. Good to go. So basically, we have made a stop right here in somewhere in Italy, in the middle of the village. Because if you walk straight this side along the mountains, is an abandoned village. The village is this one? Yeah? Parma's village. Up, that side. As we make our way to this abandoned village, let's talk about the jobs that you can apply for here in Italy. For example, tourism is a huge industry here in Italy and you can apply for jobs as a waiter or in the restaurant or as a chef and if you speak english it's a plus point because you, it's easy for you to get a job in the restaurant or in the teaching field as a teacher teaching english and there it is our adventure to the abandoned village look at this there were probably around 20 to 30 families living in these houses living in these villages and they would have had like land behind the houses that they mostly used for farming to make grapes to grow rice vegetables to make it like you know level to fill then you just break that big chunk and then you know you just so this was used in farming basically it's, it's in, it's, 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 i have used this in my childhood in nepal are you used this for farming yes oh wow or maybe it's just used by a serial killer uh, maybe <laughs> oh wow it's very very short the roof yeah it's, it's probably a store room and or probably the italians are very short people Back in the day, maybe. Back in the day. Let's check what's happening here. There's like a, a gas cylinder here, which was probably used for cooking. I hope this doesn't explode. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Some of the structures, the roofs here are just held by a single stick so if I probably just push the stick the whole roof would come crashing down but I'm not gonna do this maybe this house belonged to an alcoholic a lot of wine bottles lying around 
along with some beer cans. If you're working in the IT or in software development or in the app development industries, then getting job is quite easy. Also in the coming years, mechanical engineers or chemical engineers or textile engineers will have a lot of opportunities here in Italy. Some of the houses here in the villages are so unstable. The structures, the walls are so unstable that they've put like a net here. So whatever stones fall down from the houses here, don't go on the highway there or the people walking down on the road. Back on the road again. All right, we are in this town called Aosta here in Italy and figuring the parking here is gonna be a nightmare is this uh put the coins put the coins here oh, ah, so no we don't have to no pay more. it's no free money. free gratuit <laughs> oui. yeah, okay. whenever you apply for a job here in Italy, there's a specific style of CV that you need to follow and recruiters usually prefer this kind of style of CV. You can find the style online. I will also link an example in the description down below. <laughs> One thing I realized here in Italy is that people have got a lot of dogs. Look, one, two, three. There's one there, four. Hello, do you serve food? Food? Uh, no, we are closing. What time do you open? Seven o'clock. Seven? Okay, yes. thank you. आप आपके पास क्या है भाई सब कुछ है ऊपर का आप क्या रेकमेंड करते हो जो आप खाना पसंद करो रेकमेंडेशन का ओके सब कुछ अच्छा है इफ यू आर फ्रॉम द ईयू देन इट्स वेरी इजी टू गेट अ जॉब यू डोंट हैव टू अप्लाई फॉर एनी वर्क परमिट बट इफ यू आर फ्रॉम आउटसाइड ऑफ द ईयू देन यू नीड टू फाइंड अ जॉब फर्स्ट एंड देन अप्लाई फॉर द वर्क परमिट All right, enough of work. Enough of work. <laughs> Let's eat. That's <laughs> kebab and chips and some chicken curry, pule pule curry, chicken curry and rice. Yeah. All right. Bon app. Bon app. Bon app. Bon appetito. Bon Italy. Bon Italy. Let's go and see what sixty euros in Italy gets you as a room. Yeah, let's do this. Up, up. Yeah. Should I knock? Oh yeah. Hello. Hola. 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 Croydon. Ricardo. Nice to meet you. Abina. Ricardo. Um, Hello. Hello. Mohamed speaking English. Yeah. <laughs> nice to meet Hello. you. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Cool. So the, this is our room. Yes. Okay. Uh, allora, terrazzo. Oops. Cucina. <laughs> okay, kitchen. Cucina. Uh, how do you say cucina? Uh, cucina. 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 Yes. Kitchen. Kitchen. Cucina. Kitchen. Cucina. Okay. Okay. Let's check out the bathroom. La mostra. Shower. No. Toilets. Okay. This is your room. Oh, this is our room. Yeah. School place, huh? Really? Nice place. And there's the balcony. with the view of beautiful Torino
Because we are in Italy, we are going to watch a game here in Italy, played by Juventus and who is the other Sampdoria. team? You see Sampdoria. Sampdoria. As you see, my football knowledge is zero, but I'm just going for the experience as we are in Italy here. No tickets. No, only online. So basically, we have not booked tickets, and they have got these counters here but they don't sell tickets they just tell you to buy tickets online i don't know why the counters are there in the first place quanto la jersey quanto 20 20 no reduction no no 10 15 no discount no discount okay no problem give me one please okay basically i was going to get my name on the jersey the indian croy the channel's name actually but it's too long so he's going to put Croy Indian Croy is too long? no no Croy is perfect Croy is perfect only yes. for letters <laughs> okay yeah it's easy for you yeah. so Juventus is the home team here right? it's the home team and that's the jersey of the home team Juventus C-R-O-Y some kind of heat or something it's, it's hot and uh, ah, it's hot yes yeah, yeah. and it sticks it's to the 150 jersey. degrees 150 degrees you want to put your hand inside right? <laughs> <laughs> ah that's cool okay. yeah 20 euro yeah okay thanks While we watch the game, let's talk about the average salaries here in Italy. The average salary ranges from as low as 950 euros to 3500 euros. The salary of a chef is around 2300 euros per month and the salary of a laboratory technician is around 2,900 euros per month. If you work in the customer service, they pay you 1,400 euros per month. If you work as a receptionist, the salary is around 1,700 euros per month. The salary as a teacher is around 2,500 euros per month and the salary as an engineer is around 3,500 euros per month. Juventus won! Juventus! 